Welcome to my new apartment. That I won't live in for the next week. At least the next week. Might be longer. Because I'm currently living in two places. And uh, it's not... It's not... It's not fun. It's an experience that I don't feel like I've ever had before. Partially because... I still have obligations for my current job and my future job has not yet begun. Oof. And so I'm kind of stuck in limbo. Like I'm, I've worked this past week and two weeks before that at the current location in St. Louis. I won't talk about where or who I work for. But I feel like I'm living in two places. And it's not fun. For a myriad of reasons, one, Expenses. Oof. I'm spending so much money to try to get over, get away from where I'm currently living. Because my mindset's already moved on. Mm -hmm. So I don't know how... It's gonna play out. But god damn, does this fried chicken taste pretty good? And I can't wait to just be moved in. I've been sleeping on blankets for the past week because I haven't had the means to like move all my other stuff. Because I still have those obligations for my current job. And I hope it never happens like this again. And there are probably things I can do to be more responsible. So if I'm living in two places in the future, that uh, those periods of time are less extended than they have been for this transition of my adult life. Ugh. I've been hesitant to go see certain doctors because I know I'm moving and I need to take care of myself and take care of these things and this is just another excuse to not do those things, which isn't a reason not to do those things, but it is another excuse. And if there's one thing I'm really good at, it's playing to those excuses. If there's one thing I'm really good at, it's allowing excuses to be more powerful than my will to do other things, other more important things. And that's something I want to break out of. Mm. I also want to break out of this. I want to eat a little bit better. But like, right now, it's all an excuse. Oh, I'm going back home in a, like an hour or two. Home. Which doesn't feel much like home because I don't have a roommate and I don't have a lot of social activities and there's just a lot of things that I just don't want to go back to. I didn't think 
Springfield would be such a an interesting time of my life. But it has been. Uh, both good and bad and neutral things. Mm -hmm. mm. I'm so into this. I love fried chicken. And these buttered biscuits. Which I think bread is killing me. So, I've been wanting to give up bread. So, there's the breading on here. There's this bread. And so, I'm like doing everything that I know or I feel like I shouldn't. And that's just another excuse, right? Like, I don't want to give this up because it tastes good. But I have a feeling that on average, my body would feel a lot better if I just changed my eating habits and put certain limitations. So in a, in a way, I would be putting a restriction on myself, but then also I would be freeing myself, you know? to do better and, and more amazing things because I'm not fatigued, you know? Like I ate a peanut butter and jelly sandwich the other morning and I was driving to work and I like started to fall asleep. I was like, no. And I got good sleep. I got like seven and a half hours worth of sleep. It was good sleep. I woke up and I was like, man, I feel great. And then I ate the sandwich and then it just kind of all went away. <laughs> And then there are other times when I'm not recording, I'm not talking to a camera, and my dialogue is just on point, right? Like, you can't, you can't plan for the times when you just go on a spiel and it just, it makes sense and you don't have to think about the words that you're going to say. It's just, it's all very fluid. And I'm getting better at that on camera because I'm like, I'm really good at talking to myself. And I've encouraged myself to talk to myself because I'm a verbal processor. So I imagine these vlogs that I try to do weekly and that I didn't do last week because um, I didn't have internet. <laughs> and now I do. But that was another excuse not to make the video because like, okay, I'll upload it. And I wouldn't have been able to upload it until like Friday. And now it's Sunday, two days after that Friday. And I'm like, okay, I need to do this again. Because this is good for me. This has more... This is not just practical in the sense that I'm building and cr building a base and creating content. It's a really shallow way of putting things. I've been thinking a lot about that too. Maybe that's for another video. But, I don't know. I've been, I've been playing through a lot of games. This week, if you can see, got this GameCube in this corner right here. I got a PS4 off screen. I got my Switch. Switch Online launched this past week. I played some of the NES games. Um... I tried to play some with my brother, but his internet connection was not good. So, <laughs> only worked so well. I got the Kingdom Hearts collection for PS4. 1.5 and 2.5 collections. And I've been playing through the, <laughs> the very aggravating experience of the original Kingdom Hearts. And I'll probably do more of that. I don't plan on taking any of my video games back with me. 
because I may be living in two places, but here in St. Louis, my heart's already here. My mind's already here. Like, this is where I want to be. And who knows when that's going to happen for sure. I will definitely talk about it. But for now, I don't have anything else to say. I just kind of wanted to get some of that off my chest. And it's probably not all of it because I've been complaining about it for weeks. <laughs> if, you, if you know me personally, you've probably heard about it. Um, so if you're interested at all, if you feel led, uh, I have, I'm part of a gaming channel, the Break Room Arcade. That's in the description below. Uh, I want to start doing more covers on this channel because I'm a musician and I like making music. I have some covers up on this channel. You can check them out here. And um, thanks for watching. I, appre uh. I appreciate it. <laughs> Goodbye.